This is Bill Hurst. I'm your Highland Hill Farm redneck, and I'm going to just, just want to tell you here, if you're a parent of a student in the Lower Marion School District, here's what I think you ought to do. I think you ought to call the superintendent of the school and demand to see all files and all data and all laptop records, any kind of paperwork that this school has on your child. You can request a meeting to see those things. They won't give you copies. They're going to make life difficult, but they have to allow you to see all the evidence that they have that they've collected that's concerning your child. And that's only fair. You should you should protect your child by finding out what they have. They could have dirty pictures of your child in, their, in your child's bedroom. The next thing I think you ought to do is you ought to write a letter to the attorney for the school district advising the attorney that you don't want the school district officials or superintendents, principals, or school board members to come on your property. I don't want them on my property. This is Bill Hurst, Highland Hill Farm. They can stay off. But just remember, you have constitutional rights. The Constitution is still with us. I know the Democrats and the, and the, the liberals are trying to, to whittle away our rights by saying it has to be interpreted in the modern world. And I don't think that, that what they meant was, you know, that they can put a little computer spy in your bedroom. But some people do think that that's legitimate. So protect yourself. You don't need a gun. The pen will work. Just give them, give them some paperwork to do. Let them, let them dig up the, the records and let them show it to you. Then you'll have a peace of mind to know what they have against your kid. Thank you. This is the berry cluster of the Blue Muffin Viburnum. It's a arrowwood viburnum that we sell here at Highland Hill Farm. It has a very glossy leaf. The old growth is glossy, but the new growth is exceptionally light colored and glossy. It's very easy to grow. It's called arrowwood viburnum by many people in the trade. It has a white cluster of flowers in the springtime and these blue berries in the fall. This set of plants here are about three to four foot high and will grow to be about 10 foot tall and maybe 10 foot wide. We're along a real busy road here. This is Route 313. We're in Fountainville, PA. And as you can see, we have a lot of plants, trees, and shrubs here at the nursery, besides the blue muffin. And over here, I'll take you over and I'll show you our double file viburnums. And these are double file viburnums. And again, these viburnums are generally considered to be deer resistant. So if you need a, a nice shrub for the background of your property, it, they make nice naturalized borders and hedges. This, is, this would also be a great choice. So give us a call at 215-651-8329. We do deliver and plant these up and down the East Coast. We have, we have viburnums both potted and bald and bald and burlap from in the field. So give us a call, 215-651-8329.